Hi guys, this is Murphy and today I am going to talk about the new Steamer Messenger bag. This bag has been launched in February 2021 here in Singapore and uh, if you're curious about it, if you've seen it in Instagram and in social media and you want to know more of the details of it, please keep on watching until the end. So when this bag is launched in 2021, I already know that this is going to be one of the hottest items that we're going to have. People here are very casual and uh, men here likes to wear t-shirt shorts and uh, sneakers and this is something that that is a men's bag that you can just grab and go. So um, I'm not mistaken because now is March but uh, the Tory Long leather is actually sold out in Singapore at the moment but it's still orderable. It's an easy bag to carry because it's crossbody and it's spacious enough for your everyday essentials. Now I'm going to start with the size. The size is 23cm by 17cm so it's actually in between small and big. It is a medium sized bag. If uh, you're going to compare it with uh, the most uh, sellable district flap bag, the district bag is 25cm in length and this new messenger bag is 23cm so it's just 2cm uh, difference there's really not much difference to it however the size the, the height is 17 cm uh, for the steamer messenger bag and uh, the district is 22 cm so it's a 5 cm difference there are two materials which are the canvas and the tori lawn leather uh, the canvas is actually the in time in monogram eclipse and uh, the Torinon leather is actually a uh, cuff leather embossed with monogram with a grainy finish that makes it scratch resistant uh, both are actually very durable if you would ask me which one is better um, for me in the long term I would still prefer a leather and personally I like a very discreet branding you can still see the logo on it but in a very discreet way the leather is a little bit uh, heavier in weight just a little bit so if you're concerned about that uh, go for the canvas but if you're more on like long-term use um, I would suggest the leather leather is also uh, more elegant for me like if you are a person who would want to somehow use it for your um, office i would say that the leather would be better because um the canvas print is the canvas print makes it more uh casual looking than uh, the leather material so uh, with the details of the bag it's actually a bag that has a flap in front with a pocket on it a pocket is big enough for you to fit two phones um, it has a zip on the main compartment it is actually also big enough for all your essentials it also comes with a signature steamer lock of Virgil Abloh that you can find also in the previous collection with the steamer backpack so uh, that also makes it special because it has this uh, Virgil Abloh touch to it um, however that lock is not functional it's just for accessories which is good because it's not very convenient for you to open and close it using that lock um, the flap on in front is actually a magnetic magnetic clasp which would be easier for you to open and close the bag um, for the top it comes with a zip which opens big enough for all your essentials so let me show you a video of uh, lvtw.hanshin that I got from Instagram uh, fitting all the items inside uh, if you're using a Braza wallet or a a uh, vertical zippy wallet it can fit inside of course if you're wearing if, if you're using the compact wallet with, with wallets which are the multiple or the slender definitely it can fit inside um i don't know about much about men's essential but i'm pretty sure that it's big enough for your sunglasses uh for your um two phones if you're carrying two phones your wallet a cigarette uh if you have other essentials that are you know that are extra you have extra space in there um if you would ask me if uh an iPad could fit inside no we tried it before so uh, no this is not a bag if you want uh, an iPad to to put inside the prices would be 3750 for the canvas and uh, 4700 for uh, the Tory Lawn leather of course leather would be a little bit more uh, pricey than the canvas however both are good enough it just depends on what style would you want to pull off the versatility of it I would say that this is more of the casual look but nowadays um, I see a lot of like office people uh, wearing a messenger bag together with their shirts it's all right if uh, you would go for the leather actually the leather is elegant enough for your uh, office attire it's spacious and it has a zip uh, on the main compartment so it's secured for all your things if traveling will be back soon it's actually a perfect traveling bag because uh, 
it's zipped. It's a classic. I would say that it will stay for quite some time in, in Louis Vuitton. I would think that basically most of uh, every man could wear it, like whatever height or built you are, uh, the size is just enough. It comes with an adjustable strap where you can just adjust on whatever length you want to wear it with. Now for the title of this video, I think it's an underrated bag because to be honest, I haven't seen a lot of people uh, wearing it since we launched it and uh, I haven't seen a lot of people also um, inquiring about it. This is a bag that I would think is a classic that you can wear for a long long time in any uh, casual occasion. And now that uh, we couldn't go anywhere and some people are not even going to their office if you were just you want to feel good get a new bag that you know that you are able to use and make use of the value of it this is actually a bag that is worth it to get because um in a few years time if traveling comes back uh you can still use it for traveling you can use it now just going to the mall going to the movies or just going out eating with friends so yeah i think this is a bag that is actually worth it so um I hope I have answered all the questions in your mind about this bag. If you have more questions about it, please just comment down below or PM me on my Instagram. And also please follow my Instagram. It's murphylvsg. I've always been updating all the new items in there and the hottest items that we have in the store and the rarest as well. Just uh, please follow me. Next week, I am going to make a review about the LV EC pouch on strap. It is a new small bag that I would think that is a very good casual bag for everyone. If you want to know more about this bag, just wait for my video next week. I couldn't give you a definite date because uh, my day off is not fixed. So just bear with me and just wait for it. For now, just subscribe so you'll get notified if I have a new video coming in. Alright, okay, I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.